Hey everybody, we're here again at the Wii Studio to show you another brand new model from Wii Knives. This is the Wii Snick. Guys, this is a really cool nested frame lock titanium 20 CV knife. You've got to check it out. Come on in and take a close look. Guys, this new knife launched on November 30th, so it is available at dealers right now. It's available in five different models. All of them are a 20 CV blade steel with a titanium nested frame lock. Uh, that nested frame lock is something that we did just recently on a knife that you probably would remember, uh, the Smooth Sentinel. Um, it's really cool. This one is, uh, if you like that nested frame lock titanium style, but a little bit smaller, uh, this is the knife to take a look at. Otherwise, today we're talking about the Snick, um, which shares that feature um, where you've got an overlay on the frame that comes all the way down from the, the tip to tail and your frame lock is nested inside that. So it's kind of a unique styling, um, which I really like. Um, the thing that I like about it is that uh, when you are have your hand on the handle there, it does not push on the frame. Um, so sometimes when you, your fingers are on that frame lock and you try to release the blade, it uh, puts a little bit of tension on it and makes it more difficult. So you don't have that problem with this knife. Um, we have in these four different versions, We've got this one here with the carbon fiber inlay. We've got a black G10 inlay. We've got a natural G10. Got a really beautiful Kuborsha wood. Um, this is one of, probably my favorite version right here. Um, I just love the way that it looks on that black titanium frame um, with the black stone wash blade. And then we've got the green micarta inlay. And again, all these are titanium handles, uh, titanium clips, titanium hardware. The clips are reversible, so you can pop that off and stick it on the other side for left-hand carry. Um, guys, look at the blade on this thing. We've got a really nice blade shape here um, with a generous belly, um, nice flat grind going from the edge all the way up to the top. Very similar to a couple of other models that have come out recently from Wii and Civivi, um, but uh, this one has uh, just a little bit more, more flair to it, I would say. So, let's get into some of the specs on this knife. The overall length on the Snick is 8.01 inches. The blade length is 3.47 inches. When it's closed, it's 4.54 inches and it's got a blade thickness of 0.13 inches. The handle is 0.46 inches. And this is a really lightweight knife um, due to the titanium frame and those inlays. It comes in at 3.43 ounces for the G10 versions, 3.3 um, ounces for the carbon fiber, and 3.22 ounces on the wood version and the micarta comes in at 3.26 ounces. And there is a version that I'm not showing here today that is a, a Timascus and Damasteel um, blade version. That's a limited edition. Um, there's not a lot of those available. If that's your jam, those things are $750 MSRP. You might be able to find one for around $650 if you're lucky. Guys, fortunately, the other versions that are not Domasteel and Tamascus are a little bit more reasonable. You can pick these up for right around $280 uh, MSRP, and the so you'll be able to see them probably at dealers for right around uh, $240. Then you'll be able to pick up the carbon fiber version. That one runs about $305 for the MSRP, so about 15% less than that. You'll be able to grab it from a dealer there. Um, guys, fantastic knife. You're going to like this one. Um, I don't know if you noticed that. I, I should show you. I just was able to do a middle finger flick on that. That's kind of fun. Uh, your finger, there's enough blade sticking out on there that you can do that. Um, the action on this thing, beautiful as you would expect. So um, let's give one away. I haven't given done a giveaway on the Wii channel for a little while either. Um, it's between this or the next video. So uh, we're gonna go ahead and do it right here. This is the Wii Snick, guys. In order to get entered into the drawing, just leave me a comment. Any comment will do. And we're gonna give this away on December 16th. So come back here, we'll have the winner posted in the comments. Uh, good luck and Merry Christmas.